last she saw a glimmer of light and ran towards it. The passage opened into a thick clump of brambles and briars under some tall trees. Primrose had no idea where she was. I can't see the oak tree, she said in a small voice, and I can't see the willow by the stream. I think I must be lost. It was getting very dark. Big drops of rain began to fall and splashed through the leaves around her. Primrose huddled under a toadstool and tried not to cry. In the distance, a lonely owl hooted, and the branches of the trees above creaked in the rising wind. There were little scrambling noises in the bush quite near to Primrose, and these worried her most of all.